welcome to Let's Play Forza Motorsport 3 Part 217. And we are going to be driving the number 45 Flying Lizard Porsche for this segment. So, off we go to the R3 Speedway Challenge. Going to be the only Porsche in this. As you can uh, plainly see, Davis is using one of the, uh, I think it's a Nurberg Viper, number 126, not sure. And hey, we're going to all three tracks this time in this segment. Woo, starting with Sedona. Okay, um, let's try this again. This time with much less downforce. <laughs> God, this car is happy. As fuck. Alright. Oh. Well, we got a shit launch, and I missed a shift, so it, it kind of balances out. Never mind. I'm like, ooh, Muller got a shit launch. I'm gonna be able to pass him here. Nope. And four lower downforce doesn't help me. Oh, please, car. Okay, now it's helping. I keep slipstreaming, because you know that's a good idea. Right, what are you gonna do here on the exit? You gonna park the bus? No? Okay. I'm actually surprised about that. Let's see if he does some, uh, at least Muller does some brake tap in there into three. Oh god. How did I not get damage from that? This game has been very, uh, lenient towards damage lately. By lately, I mean since, like, the beginning of the fucking professional section. It's really weird. Oh boy, door to door for the lead. Don't mind me. Just going to, uh, maybe insert myself into this if I can swoosh on down to the bottom here. Swooshed on down to the bottom. And at least got more. Let's go to work on Davis now. Ooh, gotta run into turn three. This is the brakes. I have to lift a little bit. Okay, we're good. And now I gotta hold off the Viper. Easier said than done. Phase by that exit. Then he fucking flat foots it through there. Ooh. The only reason I let him on the inside was I knew he was gonna tap the brakes. So, ah. Uh. Well, in this situation, the Viper is in fact faster than the Porsche. See, Davis kind of fucked off a little bit there. Okay, not sure what happened. Who knew? I'm slightly off my line. Time to fucking stop the car. That's probably what happened. Closing the gap either. That's what you get when you fall out of my slipstream. You suck. Fuck you, Davis. At least he's, you know, the top AI cars of life on like the last, you know, Class S series. Also, wasn't there a Viper in a Class A series that was also bottom of the barrel? I think there was. Question the spelling of things, soccer versus pronunciation. Oh, yeah, 
there we go, a gain and a half second on that lap. He's definitely given up. Like fall out of slipstream range, suddenly they're just slower, but on slow as blah 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 blah. Grandma, anyways. Or no, granddad. Granddad pace. At least I know I can win. <laughs> That's good. Let's go like this. <laughs> the lone Porsche entry. This is a flying lizard after all. It's not just any normal lizard, it's a flying lizard. And it flies to Vic. Shut up, mate. Shut up. So, here we go, race one done. And, uh, yeah, let's move on to, I believe, Peninsula is next, so that'll be... That's gonna be the most interesting one, because just flat foot throughout the entire lap. Alright, race two. Here we go, it's Peninsula time. And it's around the, uh... The normal direction, so we don't get the, uh, advantage of advantage of the AI being stupid and also shit. So I'm actually gonna have to try here. Come on, slipstream, don't fail me now. Although I'm a little too far away for it to uh, actually help me. Hopefully once we exit turn three, things will uh, balance out. Although I'm catching them now. So I guess that slipstream is helping. So we're now at the top speed threshold. Alright, how are these guys going to exit this turn? Flat out, okay. I'm actually a little surprised at that. Yeah, the AI is more retarded at right turn. Case in point, last, uh, last segment where Davis ran a 42-2 uh, as his best lap going this way, but a 43-3 going the other way. Also, hey, into Pete <coughs> 1 I go, excuse me. You going, Davis? He's trying to Larson Lane. Oh, oh, man. <laughs> Looks very different suddenly behind me. Shit's getting intense in my mirrors. We got some pack racing going on here. Got the, uh, the SCCA cars charging up through the field. It's going to be interesting. Fucks off behind, okay. Well, I guess it's just me and Miller now. And that very, very sexy Mopar liveried Viper. Like the car and delivery are sexy. Equal parts. Oh, hey, Ludo. 
three to go. And Jones has taken third. Davis in fourth. Not sure what happened behind that just, uh, kind of made everyone park. It's interesting. I like that tear-off flap on the left side of the, uh, left corner of the windshield that, you know, even though the there's no evidence of tear-offs on the screen. It's all just, like, this... <laughs> there's no, like, tinting to it. Alright, two to go. Everyone else is catching. And by everyone else, I mean Jones and Davis. Other Corvettes, uh... I don't know what he's doing. I had supercars running in fifth. By that I mean the Commodore. Here comes Jones with a lot of momentum. This is going to be quite the finish here. I'm just going to pull a block here on Miller. Oh no. No you don't. No. None of that now. Jones trying to pull a fast one on me. Nice try, buddy. Suck it. All right. Well, that was a fairly intense race behind me. With the uh, the world, ch two of the world challenge cars finishing on the podium. Nice. Okay. Well, there we go. Here's that. So uh, back to actually having to dr uh, steer the car. To Motegi to finish this off. Uh. Okay, um, attempt two at Motegi, because uh, that last attempt ended in a very, very heavy impact. That, that, was, that was a heavy impact, alright. Thank you. Okay. So. Um, let's try this again. I'm off to a worse start now. Go me. Looks like my time gainer is going to be exiting four. I should submit that to Fellers, actually. I, I should. Probably won't get in, but hey. Oh, come on, car. Grip for me. I don't have minimum downforce, but let's do this shit. Come on. Use that slipstream. Alright, round Muller. Oh, drove it hard into turn three. Somehow got a good exit, though. So that's good. 
Hello, Phil. Okay, now, can I catch Davis? Well then, not sure what the fuck you're doing, Evans, but, uh, okay. You go ahead and fight with more. I'm gonna try to catch this vip vap. I'm not sure what kind of plan that was, but it didn't quite work out on the exit here. Okay, the gap is at one second. Yeah. What I need to do is I need to even things up between me and Thunder getting on fail race. He's beating me two to one now, damn it. Done fuck this up. That was awful. That was absolutely awful. And I lost three tenths. That was that was terrible. I need to not do that. Exit, we'll take that. Any features on fail rest if I had one? Just the RC2 clip. You know, the one where he fucking he forgot that the game was RC2. I like how he like saw that clip and just added it immediately instead of, you know, waiting. Like he put that at the top of the priority list. It's a mighty impressive rule. Wait, Thunder's had three? Oh, he's had three. He's had three? Let's see, there was... There's the Midnight Club one... Call McFly... Wait, did he have two Midnight Club clips, actually, now that I think about it? That made it. Two of them, okay. Oh, hey, I'm in Slipstream Ranger Davis. Good, because there's only uh, fucking two laps to go. Actually, Talos Thunder's most recent endeavor was the Colin McFly one, because it got into episode 99. It was also the thumbnail for episode 99. Ooh, how you doing, Davis? We in there. What is up, Mang? About to spoil your victory. Dive. Oh, diving up into him. Oh god, that was alright. That was Ryan Newman at Phoenix Dive from a couple years ago. That was actually pretty god awful. I was hoping for a clean dive, but um that didn't work. Go me. Still won the race, but that did not work at all. That was definitely a Ryan Newman uh, Phoenix dive right there. Oh, shit. Okay, well, R3 portion of Speedway Challenge complete. Ah. Yay, I don't know. I'm actually surprised it didn't spin out there. My car is able to, like, yeah. But, um, I don't know. Anyways, there we go. Two more Speedway classes to go. Next time on Forza, we'll move on to R2! Oh boy, so stay tuned for that.